Hello students, welcome back to our channel Diksha Karnataka. KSET 2024 counseling process has started and we are at the stage of option entry, the most crucial step that will decide the college and the course that you are going to study for the next four years, right? Yes, so it is a very important step and there are chances of making mistakes in this step. So yes, here I am in this video discussing the top eight last minute tips that you must follow so that you can avoid any type of mistake and you can prepare the best preference list for yourself. You can make the best option entry for yourself so that you can get the best college for yourself, right? Yes, so yeah, uh, let us get started here. So this, if you follow these eight last minute tips for option entry, I can guarantee you that you can ensure your best college of choice, okay? So here is one uh, important information I think all of you might be knowing by this time. But yes, I have put this to remind you that 30 July 2024, 8 a.m. is the last date, is the last time to put your all options to arrange all your preferences, right? So that is very, very important. Please remember this date and time, 37, 2024 up to 8 a.m. Okay, so by this time, whatever modification like editing you want to do in your preferences, you can after this, it won't happen, right? So that is why here I'll discuss the last eight minute tips that you must follow to make the best preference list. So what is the first tip that we have here is first one, review your option list, review it again and again, again and again, check that you have put all the colleges and courses that you wish to join. Second, ensure your top choices are accurately prioritized. So whatever colleges that you are very interested, put it at the first, the rank, check it with your cutoff marks and then arrange it properly. Third, make sure you haven't missed any important options. You know, there is only one time option entry. You cannot add any other options later. So just check that you have added all the options right now in the first round option entry. Okay. So, so this is very important step. You have to review your option list many times. Again and again, you just check it. And while checking, just check that these three parameters are being covered. Now coming to the second one that is Check the college and the course details. Students, it is very, very important to make the proper order and also to put the right data in the right order, right? So in the college, you have college code. So with the name, you have the college code. So ensure that you have put college code correctly. In the college code, the same college can have different codes based on the aided and unaided courses, right? So please check that. Next, check the course description. Okay, that you have put the correct courses. Okay, and the next is check the preferences order. Okay, that you have made the right order. So, yes, these three important things that you should check in college and course details. Okay, now going to the next third important tip that is check eligibility criteria. Okay, so for example, if you are belonging to certain category, so check the cutoff of that particular category and then make your preference list. Where you can see your category, you can check your verification slip, right? So in verification slip, all the data are given regarding your category, your rank, everything is there. So just check that and see that you are meeting all the criteria and your rank in that particular criteria you check and make your option entry. Now coming to the fourth tip in our list that is prioritize based on the real as realistic chances. Yes. So like here I'll, I'll want to explain this with an example. Suppose your rank in the exam is somewhere around 1500. Okay. And for example, RV college, CS branch, the cutoff is 310. Okay. So you are very far away from here, right? Sorry, 15,000. Okay. So you are very far away from this cutoff. There's no chance that you can get this branch, my dear. So that is why do not put this option at all. Okay. There is no doubt that you can put unlimited options. There is no restriction on the number of options, but it is important that you make a proper realistic option entry for yourself. So if your rank is somewhere around 15,000, so you can make option from 9,000 to 25,000 or 22,000. So whichever colleges or cutoffs are falling in this range, try to put the, those colleges, okay? So yes, your rank in the past year cutoff should have some realistic chances, okay? Even if you put this, there's no harm, but there's no chance of getting this college for you, 
okay so that is why be very careful and put those colleges which have a chance of getting now coming to the fifth one double check for errors very very important double check for errors what are the errors possible here errors can be possible in the college code you can make errors in the course description you can make error in the order of the preferences and you can make the mistake in the number of colleges that is added okay so as it is one time option entry check that you do not miss out on any college that you wish to join next college code course description and the order of preferences check it again and again again and again you check it so that you do not make any mistake and do not have to repent this is one time process students which is going to affect your career your future so investing time rechecking this one again and again is worthy now coming to the next step that is consult with trusted advisors okay so since you are doing it for the first time you are very new to this experience talk to some people discuss with some people whom you can trust who have experience in this field okay so you can talk to your teachers mentors or your career counselors or you can talk to your seniors so you can also discuss with your parents right so yes just show them your preference list okay and if they have any uh, discuss with them if they have any different opinion check on it work on it and make the best preference list now coming to the seventh one that is stay calm and focused very important whenever we are going to do something very important part as uh, in our life it is very important to stay calm and focused okay so do not get distracted while you make your option entry sit silently review your options again and again and do not panic at all okay so you have still time so do not panic do it in a very serious and focused way take a deep breath and review your choices calmly so just check your cut off again and again and review all the choices so and you have a clarity in the mind that which colleges you will be getting which colleges fall in your rank category okay now coming to the most important most important point that is submit before the deadline you have prepared for the exam you have written the exam you have got very good marks in the exam you have devoted one to two weeks of time in researching about the colleges prepared the best preference entry all is there in your rough notebook you haven't option entry you haven't done yet so last moment there will be a chances of website like uh, any problem in the website the website may hang there will be so many students rushing at that time so that is why there can be a huge traffic in the website at the last moment of time so do not wait for the last moment fill the option entry once it is done as early as possible do not keep it till tomorrow morning finish it tonight at any cost okay next aim to complete the submission process before the deadline double check your submission if it is confirmed so once it is done just download your preferences keep it together and do not wait till the last moment yes so let us quickly review all the points once again first is review your option entry second check college and course details third check eligibility criteria fourth prioritize based on the realistic chances fifth double check for errors sixth consult with trusted advisors seventh stay calm and focus and the last one very very important submit before the deadline okay yes students so we are at a very crucial stage of the counseling process this is what will decide the next four years which college which course you are getting so invest your time wisely smartly and make the best preference list if you have any doubt please comment down we will be more than happy to help you and if you have found this video helpful please like share and subscribe our channel thank you for watching and all the very best for your case 2024 counseling process